We live in a world in which governments and corporations have way too much power over us all. Today, we see a prime example of the exercise of such power. OnlyFans are going to ban adult material on their platform after pressure from the banks and payment processors. So we have a middleman that has made a ton of money off sex workers and adult content creators raking in a 20% fee off their hard work, who is now turning around and fucking them over in order to appease scumbag bankers in suits who in turn fuck over everyone else. This is why the world needs uncensorable payments. This is why the world needs Bitcoin and the Bitcoin Lightning Network. This is why the world needs systems and platforms and payment rails that content creators are in 100% full control of. It's why the internet needs revenue streams that are not reliant upon advertisers with their discriminatory policies against sex workers and adult content creators. It's why the world needs cryptocurrency micropayment solutions in which the content creators are in control of and not a third party intermediary. Now ultimately the US government could create an open source API for the US dollar and give it away to the world so anyone can be their own payment processor. But we all know that they won't do that. So we have to live in a world where third party intermediaries like banks, payment processors and the like have so much power over us all and give us only the tools with the functionality that they will allow, which is always limited. Only fans could have told the payment processors and the banks to go fuck themselves. They could have taken a couple of million dollars and given it to the Bitcoin open source community. Specifically, they could have donated the money to the BTC Pay Server Foundation and asked them to make a few tweaks to their amazing free product, BTC Pay Server. But they didn't. They didn't because investment bankers and their ilk, who have said, would have said, that's too risky. And greed would have no doubt got the better of the OnlyFans founders and insiders. They would have seen the big money is in advertising, and advertisers don't like adult content. Now the founder is probably looking to cash out as well, and investment bankers would be pressuring the founder to clean things up in order to improve the company's valuation and their ability to sell it to mainstream investors at a higher multiple of earnings. So what's the solution for OnlyFans content creators whose income will soon dry up? Number one, create your own website, which you own and you control and you manage, hosted on your own infrastructure and not in the cloud. Two, implement BTC Pay Server as your payment rail and become your own bank and your own payment processing company using this open source free solution. Three, limit your dealings with banks and payment processing companies. And that includes all of the new cryptocurrency payment processing companies as well. Four, train your customers on how to set up Bitcoin wallets on their phones and computers and advise them why they need to do this and pay you in this manner. Now, I'm making available my presentation on using BTC Pay Server for uncensorable payments for OnlyFans content creators and how I would set things up if I was a content creator that needed uncensorable infrastructure and payments. Now, the link is in the description of this video and the page was originally created with the Thailand bar owner in mind. But what will work for bar owners will work for content creators as well. Both of these types of people have the same underlying problem of requiring uncensorable computing infrastructure and uncensorable payment rails. Now, how many content creators do I think will implement this solution? Very few. Well, that's how early we are with all of this. 
That includes Bitcoin as well. All the best, everyone. I'm Clark Towson, CEO of INTJ Billing.